What's next? Well, a physician from Hartford Healthcare recently became the first in the country to use a new laser to perform a pacemaker extraction. That doctor, Dr. Craig Moskowitz, is here to talk about that technology and what it means for patients. So thank you for being here, doctor. Thanks for having me, Kara. Yeah, congratulations on this uh, new venture and tell us all about what this new laser is and how it's going to be used. Sure. So, you know, the laser is a technology that allows us to remove pacemaker wires and defibrillator wires from patients' blood vessels and the heart um, in a more minimally invasive uh, approach through just a small incision in the uh, upper chest. So who is a candidate for this technology? So any patient that has a pacemaker or a defibrillator and the wires are not working properly or if they have even an infection in the bloodstream or the valves on their heart, Oftentimes the recommendation is to remove these wires, especially for an infection, otherwise it will not heal. Uh, patients who have wires that are not working properly, just like any wire that goes to a device in your home, uh, we have to fix them. And the laser allows us to cut through scar tissue that we might not otherwise be able to do from a minimally invasive approach. So at what point do patients have to have this done? Sometimes we can try to, you know, we say program around it. So sometimes with the pacemakers, we're able to make changes without even opening up the patient using a computer. And sometimes that's successful. But if it's not, then we have to use the laser and remove these wires fully and implant a completely new pacemaker system. In the event of an infection, then we don't have a choice. We, we really have to do a full system removal. And the laser is usually our preferred tool. So how does the laser really benefit the patient? I think it allows us to tackle more complex cases. Sometimes we say, you know, it's too high risk. The, the wires have been in for even more than two or three decades. And so in the past, we haven't been able to always do these procedures, but I think the laser now, you know, it allows us to perform these procedures and more importantly, perform them successfully. Doctor, thank you so much for sharing this important information and congrats on being the first in the nation. Thank you. And for more information, you can visit hartfordhealthcare.org slash heart and learn more about this.